What's going on guys? It's Riley here. I'm going to show you how you can make your own search engine here in Google Chrome. But Riley, what is your own search engine? What the? Well, this is it. So let's say I wanted to search YouTube. All I have to type is YT and I'm searching YouTube. Bam. Or let's say I wanted to search dictionary. All you got to type is MW from Merriam-Webster. Hit space. And I'm searching the dictionary right here, right now. Easy. Yeah, basically this is just a faster way to search instead of having to actually go to Mary M. Webster. Gosh dang, it's not even saved in my thing. See? MaryMWebster.com. Have to load that page and then search for the word. Um, it just eliminates that step, so it's a lot faster. Let's do it. So you, you may have noticed that Google Chrome will actually auto will actually create some of these search engines for you. As you can see up here, it says press tab to search Google. So if I press tab, now I'm searching Google, right? So that's what we're going to create here, but we're just going to tell Google to manually do it. So how we do this is we hit the settings um, key right here and go down to settings again and then click on search engine and then manage search engines. And you're going to see a lot of entries here. Now Google Chrome made a lot of these um, by itself. For example, Amazon, it just you know, Amazon had just made it by itself. Okay, I, I didn't create that one manually. But let's say that you don't want to wait for Google Chrome to manually do it and, or it's just not doing it. So what you can do, so like here's the one I made for Marian Webster. But anyways, let's go ahead and add our own search engine. So what we're gonna do, go, come back to the top, click add, and here you can add your own search engine. In this box, we type in the name of it. So let's say, what do, what do we want to create a search engine for? Maybe eBay, okay? So we're going to name this eBay. Okay, now the keyword. This is what you're going to type into the URL bar. I created one for YouTube, so I type YT and press space. Okay, so that's what our keyword needs to be. For eBay, I'm just going to do EB. Sure, why not? Okay, now the URL. Now this is a little bit tricky. You have to kind of play around with this to determine what the URL is. And to kind of figure out what the URL is, let's go ahead and go to eBay and make a search. So eBay in here, we're gonna search for, I don't know, yeah, a disco ball. Okay, I want a disco ball for my, for my room, you know? But yeah, okay, so now that we've searched for something, we have to inspect the URL. And basically, everything is sent through the URL. Basically, what I'm trying to say is all the information that the, the server needs to send you back uh, whatever you're requesting is basically sent through the URL. So as you can see here, like uh, right here is saying we search for disco ball. Okay, also right here it says and and then nkw equals disco ball. Well, you just kind of have to experiment with this and play around with it. And I think that nkw stands for new keyword. So I'm going to try and search for something else in here. If I type in maybe I don't know, what, what do I need? Maybe a new, like, a mouse. Not like a, like a real mouse, like a computer mouse. Yeah, yeah, like a mouse. Okay, so that worked. So now we figured out where in the URL we put in our search term. Okay, so let's go ahead and copy this whole thing. Come back to um, our Google Chrome settings. Paste it in. But now we need to edit that search term right here. So mouse, when we type in mouse, we actually need to replace it with percent %s. <clears throat> and this tells Google Chrome that this is where we insert our search term, right? So URL with percent %s in place of query. Okay, this is our query. Just another term for search term. You know, they got millions of terms for everything. All right, so we're going to add that. And now, if I type eb in space, we're searching eBay. And I'm going to search for, um, I don't know, a freaking rocket ship who doesn't want a rocket ship and it worked hey, hey would you look at that so that is how you create your own google chrome search engines i hope this saves you guys a lot of time because going to the actual website first and then typing in your search is it requires two steps and you can save a step but anyways thanks you guys for watching if you like this video please, please please leave a like and if you didn't please leave a comment love to know what i could do better have a good one, guys.